We're in Edinburgh, Scotland right now, and there's a Ferris wheel right behind me, as you can see, and it's obviously using a ton of electricity. What we don't know, though, is how efficiently that Ferris wheel is running. Are all the motors running efficiently? Are the lights running efficiently? If we could map that Ferris wheel and make it run more efficiently, the cost savings and the electricity savings could be huge. I don't know if these rides could actually save 20, 40, 50 percent, but what if buildings could, if factories, hotels, hospitals? Well, they can. We're going to go see one on the outskirts of Edinburgh. As I pass through the countryside on my way to visit a high-tech factory, I'm reminded that this isn't a story about technology. It's a story about climate and the environment, because we need to cut global greenhouse gas emissions by perhaps 70 percent by mid-century. And the Jabel Corporation, a massive international company, is taking steps in that direction. This is one of their factories where they produce parts for a range of products. And it's massive, 125,000 square feet, 300 people working on the floor. To keep a factory this size running requires a ton of electricity. And because there's lots of equipment, it needs to stay cool inside. So what happens if, say, one of the AC compressors has a glitch and is wasting energy? How could we know? We probably wouldn't until now. These clamps are the key. They monitor every electron and send it to a box that uploads information to the cloud to be monitored in real time. The latest version of this technology is called Einstein. It can detect any disruptions and provide detailed accounting, potentially saving companies like Jabil millions of dollars. The technology is the brainchild of a company called Vertigris, based out of the San Francisco Bay Area. Oh, and Jabil is not only a user of Vertigris products, they help manufacture it too. Heading back to Edinburgh, I wonder if this type of forward thinking, cost-saving technology will take hold, or if we will just keep spinning our wheels.